simple equations. We are aware of trial and error method, but it is time consuming. So in order to solve the simple equations, we go for the easier methods. First of all, let us study the properties of equality. Reflexive property. Every number is equal to itself. Example, 5 equals to 5. Symmetric property. If in two numbers, the first number is equal to the second, then the second is equal to the first. Example, if x is equal to y, then y is equal to x. Transitive property. In three numbers, if the first number equal in the second and second is equal to the third, then the first number is equal to the third. If A is equal to B and B equals to C, then A equals to C. If a number is equal to each of two numbers separately, then these two numbers are equal to one another. If X is equal to A and X is equal to B, then A is equal to B. In an equation, if we add the same number at both the sides, then both are equal. Example, if 3 plus 2 equals to 5, add 3 on both the sides. We have 3 plus 2 plus 3 equals to 5 plus 3, which implies 8 equals to 8, which is true. Subtraction property if the same number is subtracted from both sides of an equality, the equality is not altered. If A equals to B, then A minus C equals to B minus C, where A, B, C are any three numbers. Multiplication property If both sides of an equality are multiplied by the same number, the equality is not altered. If A equals to B, then AC equals to BC, where A, B, C are any three numbers. Division property If both sides of an equality are divided by the same non-zero number, then the equality is not altered. If A equals to B, then A divided by C equals to B by C, where A, B, C are any three numbers and C is not equal to 0.